we're given f of x equals 4 inverse sine of x cubed and asked to determine the derivative function f prime of x, then determine f prime of 0 0.3, rounded to four decimal places. To begin, notice f of x is a composite function where the outer function is inverse sine and the inner function is x cubed. This indicates we have to apply the chain rule to find the derivative function. The derivative formulas on the right include the chain rule. Notice the derivative of inverse sine u with respect to x is equal to one divided by the square root of the quantity one minus u squared times u prime. For our given function f of x, notice u is equal to x cubed, where u is the inner function. So if we have u equals x cubed, notice u prime or du dx is equal to three x squared. So the given function f of x is equal to four inverse sine of x cubed, which now if it's helpful, we can think of as four inverse sine u and apply the derivative formula. f prime of x is equal to the derivative of four inverse sine of x cubed, which is equal to four times the derivative of inverse sine x cubed, if we want inverse sine u, which is equal to one divided by the square root of the quantity one minus u squared, where u is x cubed, giving us one minus the square of x cubed, and then times u prime, where u prime is three x squared. And now let's multiply and simplify. F prime of x is equal to 12 x squared, divided by the square root of the quantity one minus when we have powers to powers, we multiply the exponents, which gives us a radicand of one minus x to the sixth. And now we need to determine f prime of 0 0.3 by substituting 0 0.3 for x, which gives us 12 times the square of 0 0.3 divided by the square root of the quantity one minus the sixth power of 0 0.3. And now we grow the calculator. I'm using the Desmos Scientific Calculator. I will first click on the Fraction Format key on the far right, enter the numerator of 12, and then in parentheses we have 0 0.3, raise the second power. We can use the exponent key and then press two, or use the A squared key. In the denominator we have the square root of the quantity one minus, in parentheses, 0 0.3, raise to the power of six. Enter. Running to four decimal places, we have 1.0804. I hope you found this helpful.